HRAs first. They'll help save everyone, including Dylan, once I find him. Oh. Can oh. you keep him safe? Like you do with me? Thank you for the recap. That's very handy. <laughs> oh, so useful. Okay. Oh, black rock processing and central maintenance. Yes. So that means that we need to go down, down to central maintenance, which I found my way to before, and it is that away. Where I'm sure I'll be ambushed again. Actually, look. okay. And yes, sniper. Yep. Yep. Gonna be an ambush. Three, two, oh, okay. No ho 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 ho. Ow. Okay. Anyone else? Anyone else? Okay. We're good here. No one else wants to go. There we are. maintenance. Why is that always so hard to get to? Just, they can't leave me alone. Okay. No, well, I guess this is it then. Black rock down. Oh. No. No. And they're gonna get the field and shit, huh? Okay. Well. Let's, uh. Let's see what we can do about this, shall we? Oh, right. Ha! Glass is not cover. I suppose that's good to keep in mind. This joker. That's right. Oh, my God. Who now? Jump through here? Can I jump through here? Now I can jump through. Excellent. Okay. Oh, when there's no tunnel, make one. Perfect. Uh, I guess I. Do I have access level 4? Unclear. Nope. Nope. 
<sighs> that is... Oh! Atlas Chamber! Wait a minute. Like the Large Hadron Collider? Oh! Large Hadron Collider. I get it. Oh, shit. That's bad. Hmm. Alright, well... First of all, let's see if I have first level four here. <gasps> I do. Wait, what is this? Oh my god. Steam. Steam overlay. Seems to be. <gasps> okay. That seems like something I probably would find it very difficult to beat the cross on. What about down here? Okay. Treasure box, that's great. Let's see what we have here. Special gremlin, always useful. And, uh. What if we... Take you and throw you, say, up in here. Am I gonna stop you? Ha! Not even close. Okay. Well, if that's what it does to a giant metal thing, just imagine what it'll do to my squishy body. Unless... supposed to be here yet. No health damage. That's great. Now oh then, about those other things. No, not either. Am I really going to have to? I really am going to have to jump back across and get the other. Okay, fine. <laughs> Random thing I threw. No worries. Okay, I think, um, it's entirely possible I'm not supposed to be here yet. It is very entirely possible I'm not supposed to be here yet. Will I die if I leap down here? Where will I end up? Oh. Well, let's try. Okay, cool, fine, got it, neat. 
Alright. Let's go to Black Rock. Black Rock down. Oh shit. Okay. Really? Really? Okay, we're gonna we're, we're gonna do it this way. The place I just was is actually the place I should have been and just pulled the damn light switch. Okay. Well, that'll teach me to be all trepid and shit. Okay. Up. Oh, Up. Oh, and up. Oh. again, huh? Yep. Where from now? What? <laughs> okay. That, uh, that's cool. This is a real place. That people stumble into. Let's, uh, let's straighten up in here. Tidy up a bit. Okay. Exactly the same. Neatness and everything. The law of three. Okay. Hello, Black Rock Processing. There's the turbine room. Here is where I drop down. And do not die. Uh, I think. Did that hurt me? Hard to say. Yeah, this is a really fucking big place that we're going into here. <sighs> okay. okay, Atlas Chamber, huh? We need to find a way to Black Rock Processing. That's where Marshall said we'd find a prism. 
Again, just on principle. of your workspace have been rearranged, removed, added to, or altered in any other way, you should immediately leave the area while speaking to yourself in a reassuring tone. This will not only keep you calm, but also the room. Thank you for your attention. Ah. I love that. Nope. Okay. Network disconnected. Okay. So, what is this about Alice? Tell me about Alice. Oh, clusters. Okay. That's what those are. Uh, okay, we've already talked about his snipers. Oh, God. Yeah. Warped. Well, documented apps observation. Okay, yes. Astral nuts. Uh, oh, what about the threshold kids? Huh. Okay. A budget would be minimal. For the threshold kids. I took a few puppet making courses at my local community theater. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, Atlas. Let's look at Atlas. Yeah, this is a physical expression created by the oldest house. Its purpose and function are currently unknown. The specific shape and dimensions of the atlas seem to indicate a more explicit purpose than the oldest house's usual walls, floors, or shifts. The atlas changes form but resists observation when doing so. Interesting. Functional observation we made during its change and only ever occurs between frames when monitored by surveillance cameras. Ha! Okay, cool. Black rock prisms. Right, okay, yes. Oh, group think. Okay. Cool. Popularized by 1984. Okay, so actually, this door was completely unnecessary once one recognizes that one can just shoot through windows for fun and profit. Okay. What do we have here? Okay. I'm assuming this is not like some kind of wall that can be broken right here. Yes, it does not appear to be so. Just put you right over there. Uh huh. Okay. What do we have here? Okay. Let's explore this place over here first. Oh. Okay. Sounds of 
fire for it. Oh, okay. actually do it this time. Who knows where I'm spawning in all this? Jesus Christ. But it don't be all the way back at the, back at the fucking reactor. Oh my god it is. Oh for fuck's sake. Let's just make a beeline here. So now we're gonna get. No, I can't make a beeline. Fine. Miss like a ritual point or something around here? I'm pretty sure I didn't. No, I really didn't. Oh, for crying out loud. Hello, Seth. Good to see you here. I would ask how you're doing, but I think I've got a pretty good idea. Okay. Yay, this is open.
more on the ball with these rockets. See, you're still you. Yeah. Medic, what's the damage? They've each taken a few hits. We need to get them to a surgical station ASAP, but I don't think there's Good. To move. Oh, yeah? Well, they're gonna have to be. Because we are moving out, and I am not leaving them behind. Now, do what you need to do. Yeah, I really loved P5. That was a fun game. Hey, thanks for bringing down that... Whatever the fuck that was. But we are barely holding on here, boss. How's the situation outside maintenance? What do I tell him? The truth is harsh, but these people seem familiar with death. The hiss are everywhere. Most of the bureau is lost. We need Black Rock Prison to make more HRAs for any survivors in the safe rooms. I'm here to check Darling's Black Rock lab. So to recap, uh, death, disaster, and imminent destruction. Another day at the FBC. But Darling's lab is just past Blackrock processing. I got good news and I got bad news on that front. The good news is, it's right down the hall. The bad news is, a Hiss monster has decided to move in, so that's great. Monster. That's what the Rangers said. The ones that survived, anyway. But we are just treading water here, and the Hiss keep coming. Salvador would know what to do, but apparently he took a security team into the containment sector just before the lockdown happened, and well, no one's seen him since. But hey. Hmm. At least we got you, our fearless leader. They shouldn't rely on me. They don't know me. They don't know how I failed people. You've done a good job here, Arish. But you should take your people and get to the base and executive. You can regroup there. I'll go deal with this monster. I'm getting kind of used to them. Aye, aye, Faden. And be sure to put a bullet in that thing for me. find a black rock prism why why do I come back with a whole sack of them just in case Ranger squad Charlie 7 returned from an expedition into the quarry threshold just after 0500 Zulu can you please state your names and describe the purpose of your expedition Kevin Horowitz Rupert Well our mission was to map quarry grid coordinates G29 Secondary objective, as always, was to find a route from the threshold entrance and maintenance to the formation. Secondary objective was not a success. 
water Kill supply. Hiss, I buy a shot. And did you encounter any previously home. unrecorded event or entity while inside the threshold? No, nothing. Do you think we should tell them about the mermaid? Excuse me? Yeah, the mermaid. Horowitz here found this mermaid in the quarry, just sitting on some black ink. What? She was what? singing this beautiful song, and he was overcome with desire. Oh, she was so alluring. I'd say she was more enchanting than alluring. Fine, enchanting. <laughs> Did you tell your CO about this? No. Because it didn't happen. Nothing happened. As usual, the quarry is full of rocks. That's it. Can we go now? <laughs> Fuck you guys. Get out of here. <laughs> well, let me first go down here and see what I can do with some points or something. Yes, please. All right. Ooh, nice. Hmm. You know what? Extra health. Very nice. But I'll go for launch damage since I seem to be using that a lot. How are we doing on astral constructs? Ooh, I can upgrade my grip now. <laughs> You're skipping everything story. Well, and I mean, Saf, like most of the story you know already, right? Like, I know there's some new stuff, but um, hopefully that's not too impactful. Although, I don't know, maybe I could be, you know, underestimating. Okay. Oh, geez. Do I do personal mods or weapon mods? Tricky. Let's go for personal mods. I choose you. Wait. Can I upgrade? Hey, health boost. Yeah, okay, just wanted to play. I like that. Accuracy boost. And shield reload deficiency. Oh, interesting, okay. It's good to know I can. Unmerciless, Jesus Christ. Saf, you're insane. <laughs> Kill enemies without dying. Okay, yeah. Oh, that is what you waited years for. I can't, uh, can't deny that. All right, do I have the map for this now? Yes, yes I do. Cool. All right, well, I've got more drink to finish here, so... Let's see what we've got here as far as a hiss monster. Seems exciting. That's the biggest thing about Whirly you were excited for. I... Uh... In that regard, I think we're very different gamers. Yes, if I end up borrowing it and streaming, you will be able to tell some story then. But no, I do think that we're very different gamers in that regard, because I do not enjoy playing things on overly difficult modes. It's not, it's not fun to me. And maybe that makes me not a real gamer. But I am... wasn't kidding about that monster. I'd definitely rather get through a game and see what happens 
then test myself, throwing myself against something over and over again. Yeah, you just like it if you're good at the game. I mean, yeah, fine. Like, <laughs> if you're good at the game, that's something else entirely. something at least moderately explosive. I know we have something around here. There we go. Perfect. And especially since I just upgraded that damage. You showed me the HRA when I first got here. And the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? Okay. But where's this monster? Yeah, monster, monster, monster. Okay. Fuel tank on the forklifts might be worth grabbing. Are you telling me? I'm gonna have to put this down. Which means throw it. And grab the prism before the monster shows up. Okay, fine. I'll throw yourself at it over it over its games I especially enjoy, like Fire Emblem and Persona, where my neural natural play style to enjoy it tends to be meticulous, but then the gameplay becomes dissatisfying. You're too strong. Oh, see, I'd rather just see how the story unfolds, and I don't. I. I know my playstyle does not reflect this so far as you've witnessed, but I actually don't want to encourage myself to be a completionist. Um, I end up being more of a completionist than I want to be on a bunch of these things. But I don't like spending the extra time. I have too many games that I want to get through. I want to. Too many. Shit! What the fuck? Too many. Too many things. Yeah, too many things I want to do. Alright. You're around here somewhere. Where are you? You're over there, aren't you? Okay. Well then. Let's just, uh... Oh! Whoa, no, wait a minute. No, you're not over there. That's just... Wow. Okay. Well then. All right, you like to play with, with mechanics, but to me that is part of the thing that takes an unnecessary amount of time to enjoy the game. Like, I enjoy cool mechanics, but having mechanics that um, sort of yeah having mechanics take a lot of time just makes it kind of unsatisfying to me if I'm spending more of my time on mechanics than I am like on progressing through the game Arush wasn't kidding about that monster. Play something else. You showed me the HRA when I first got here. And the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? Oh, 
Oh my god, really? Rocks? I have this fuel can here and I get rocks? Wait, really? Really? Jesus Christ. But when you like to fiddle with things other people might find it tedious or boring, then when you're like, I wonder if I can make a cool unit or persona and neat, or if I want to see all the social links, I just end up too strong for the game to feel like anything. I guess I only enjoy progressing when it feels like I earned it, otherwise progressing is just tedious. Like, great, I'll auto-battle all enemies, beat the boss, then repeat. I mean... Yeah, right, and I guess that's really... a large part of the difference I'm getting at. Like... Yeah, I... You know, in most cases... I want to see how the story of the game unfolds. I want to see the narrative. I want to see the twists or what the game developers had in mind when they created this thing as far as how the plot unfolds. I am less concerned about like how to build a really amazing character that uh, you know, that will beat the socks off of anything except the things on the hardest difficulty modes. Let's see, whereas if I'm making choices that allow me to be strong enough to do things, the choices are the fun. Yeah, and that's fine. Um, yeah, like I said, that's just a time investment I'm not prepared for. Uh, which I think is the difference between you and me, because you really seem to get into that, and I would rather uh, kind of go through the game and get to the end so I can go on to the next game that I've really been looking forward to. You know, I've got, at this point, 1800 games in my Steam library, and a lot of them are actually really good, uh, and I, I, I want to, to consume them in a way that's meaningful. Mm. I need to find game stories very good usually. Yeah. Yeah, no, that definitely tracks with you. <laughs> uh, you. You are the consummate media critic. Um, I, yeah, and like, in playing a game, I can get enough of a sense of sort of the mechanics and what the developer is going for that I don't feel like I need to optimize them to get the, uh, you know, the level of nuance required to appreciate them. And I feel like if you do need to play on the very hardest difficulty level to appreciate the mechanics, that's kind of a feeling failing of the game. Uh, much like I'm sure you think that a lot of game plots and stories uh, fall down. Hmm. Anyway. This boss is going to be a serious pain. Let's see. A completionist or... Meticulous, yeah. Well, but you like to optimize your, you know, persona or units or whatever to the point where they are, you know, the best they can be, right? I mean, okay, I'm... Optimized. Meticulous. Okay, I guess, um... That's, uh... That's... I, I guess I was taking them to be closer to the same thing that you are. You hate 
complete, optimizing and completing. Okay. But you like testing the mechanics? Or I don't I don't know anymore. <laughs> I don't know. I know that whatever it is you enjoy doing, it's not what I enjoy doing in games. <laughs> and that is that is why I think we're different gamers. I've seen you play Hades. Or Zelda, yes. Uh, well, but that's a very different thing from a Persona or a Fire Emblem Tactics game, where you have a lot of a lot more range of customizability like Hades is sort of you get a random deal and sometimes it takes you far and sometimes it doesn't and Zelda you have a bunch of you know mechanics that you use to interact with this open world but I don't think it's as possible to do the same things that you do in Hades or, or sorry in um, Fire Emblem or um, Hades and Fire Emblem, yeah, yeah. Uh, Fire Emblem or, or or Persona in terms of like long term planning. Unfortunately, I don't have a lot of source to lose up here from dying a whole bunch, so, uh, you know, that's good. Hey, Grip. What else do we have? Headshot damage, accuracy, reload speed while shielded. Uh, none of these are great for the grip. Uh, accuracy boost. Weapon armor damage. Low health boost. Christ. Okay. Uh, right. You played Fire Emblem a bunch of times without doing any completion or optimization. Same with Pokemon Snap, which you absolutely can do both things with. Okay. Okay. Okay, so what... What kind of player would you describe yourself as, then? You just get good at things you like. Okay. All right. No, that's that's good. Like, yeah, if you like things, keep playing them. Get good at them. Absolutely. Um, I just know that when we were talking earlier yesterday, you said that you wanted me to play on hard mode because that felt like it was the same experience and I felt like I was being asked to play in a mode that I don't normally like to play for my own reasons. Um, so, you know, like, I'll do that, but it's not what I would naturally choose. And 
you know, we'll see how it goes because, like, Persona 5 is still in its early game. Oh, what else do I want here? I mean... Like, I tried to say it, but, uh, you know, you kind of kept repeating your case. So I, I sort of let it drop and went along with uh, what you asked, and, you know, we'll see how it goes. Hard might be perfectly fine. I might be perfectly okay on hard. Uh, like I said, it's just not what I would have naturally chosen. Uh, so we'll give it a shot. And uh, if I need to, we can, uh, you know, put the difficulty back down uh, if I find that I'm getting frustrated. Uh, like I'm getting frustrated with this game in this boss battle right here. Uh, it seems unnecessary. <laughs> One more try, and then I'm going to end the stream. And I suspect that this will probably not go so well. Although, I should change the spin for the grip now. Don't need the headshot boost, but I think I will need... Let's go for damage boost. Wish I had a better one. Arish wasn't kidding about that monster. You showed me the HRA when I first got here. And the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? Wait! They're shattered! Not a single prism left. going to do it now. Walk around with a shield and wait for it to amplify. That's, uh, that's how we do it. Um. Oh, boy. Hopefully, this will be a relatively straightforward battle. I mean, I wouldn't like finding cool moves and making cool personas and getting cool confident abilities if I could auto-battle the whole game. And finding and building that stuff is the game for me. Okay, yeah, and, and that's great. Like, I'm really glad that that's what Persona's about for you. Um, yeah, I... I'm happy that you love those things, and I bet that they are really cool in Persona. And I'm sure I will get a taste of them. Okay, that's not being optimizer. I mean, fine. I'm sorry I misspoke. There are areas in the oldest house where under the right conditions, when the frequencies match, other dimensions leak in. Oh my god. We call these areas thresholds. There is not the actually a safe is point one here. Of the stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's that's where Blackrock comes from. You Extra heard that too, right? Dimensional matter. 
black rock comes from a threshold. Ari. So the prisms must be there too. Think of it as paranatural lead. Our research involves many dangerous things we absolutely need to keep in check. That's what the Black Rock Line fire breaks are about. The panoptican container cells. Uh, sorry to interrupt, sir, but I need the code for the guard elevator. Oh, uh, Emily. The codes. Black Rock 665. Neighbor of the Beast. Ha! <laughs> 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 Neighbor of the Beast, okay. We can do that again. <laughs> That was priceless. Wow. Darling's key. This should get us into the quarry. Okay, I now have clearance level five. That is clearance for basically everywhere in the building, as far as I can tell. Great. That's awesome. Before I do anything else. <laughs> I'm going to ransack a new area, apparently. No, load out. Oh. Okay. What do we have here? 34%, 30%. Cool. You're gone. Next time, I'm going to have to do some inventory management. <sighs> if only ever completed one game in your life, being called a completionist is straight weird to me. Okay. No, that's fair. That's fair. I didn't know you had only completed one game in your life. I thought that... Uh, you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm going to head back and save. And... End the stream so I can go to bed. Uh, yeah, that you're right. That's not being a completionist. And I don't know what the word is you would prefer, but clearly I'm not using it. So uh, we will. We will call it here. <sighs> okay. Cool. That's great. I do look forward to playing Persona. And, um... We'll see how it goes. Like, Persona 5 is really cool so far. I've been enjoying it. And I hope you find some new stuff in your playthrough. Yeah, we will end this here because it is time for me to head to bed. So, good night, everybody. See you later.